What's going on, everyone? Welcome to Charting Crypto. Today we're over Vector Space AI or VXV, which is down 4.4% at 43 cents, 50 billion max supply, very, very small market cap of only 16 million and 37 million coins in circulation. I've mentioned this pretty much every time I've charted VXV. I think this coin could perform exceptionally well in the bull run due to the low market cap and low circulating supply. Last bull run was 1919. We're still down 97.75% from that all time high. I think we could easily overtake that all time high this upcoming bull run. So with that, let's get into the price prediction and technical analysis on VXV. Okay, everyone, it's been a while since I charted VXV, so that was a prior chart there. We still are within this downtrend. We wicked above it briefly on the 17th and 18th of March, but fell right back into it. Looks like we're at a very, very critical support area. Let me draw a horizontal line here where we're currently at. You can see in the past, this is the general area where we tried to have some support. You can see January 18th, February 1st, big support here on the 10th of March. And right now, I think we're sitting right on it. Let's zoom in here. We're sitting right on it. We can't fall below this. We fall below 42 cents. It's going to get nasty. It's going to get very, very nasty. We're below the main price volume area. So we're going to draw a large fib on this and try to see what's going on. We're actually going to go from the tippy top. And I believe we're going to go to the lowest low, which is this wick right here. Yeah, this is what we're respecting. That's the 382. That horizontal line that I drew was the 382. So we can't fall below the 382 or we're going to be seeing a quick capitulation down to around 34 cents. Um, zoom in here. We are a little bit below it. I can probably adjust that a little bit. We can give just to fit the narrative. Um, if we just go to the bodies bodies of the candles, that would be the 6382 right there. So 382 is our support right now. If we do get a bounce off this, we're going to be working our way back up towards this resistance area at around 50 cents. So what I'm thinking is happening, if we just continue doing something like this, eventually we have to break out one way or the other. And when it breaks out, it's going to be big. We're either going to be breaking out to 64 cents, or if we break below the 618, we're going to be breaking down to 33 cents. So keep an eye on what direction we break out. It's going to be happening pretty soon. The latest this can run is April 9th before this consolidation has to break somewhere or this downtrend has to break somewhere if this is the start of a con consolidation between the 382 and the downtrend indicators right now we we're we still are bearish on the macd but we're not having really large bearish movement on the macd there which shows that this might be the bottom and we might be working our way back up towards um that downtrend rsi is extremely low wtx is extremely low and the main thing i want to look at here is the gmma gmma has printed red so we're trying to cross over green, but now we're riding side by side. So it's going to be very, very um, interesting next couple of days. I would say if we break below 40, what's that? 42. Yeah. If we break below 42 cents, I'd be very, very careful because I, I could see a pretty large drop coming from that point. Uh, probably a 22% drop down to 33, but who knows that could bring your V-shaped bottom in and we could get out of here. Similar to what happened right here. You can see we're consolidating the 618 and then we fell off the table to the 382. Um, so I'm going to have to be bearish here on the short term for VXV guys. It's not looking good. We're kind of hanging off the edge of a cliff. The only thing you got going for you that here is staying above that 382 and consolidating. That's your only hope right now. Uh, let's look at the one day chart, uh, one day chart. Wow. The one day chart. You guys are like massively oversold here on VXV for some reason, been consolidating on the RSI pretty much since September of 2022. But if you look at the. WTX, 